So we're going to Monsters Inc. then. Wait, so we oh, have... I, I, I love this cutscene, actually. Humanity is a precious gift, and yet you desire to return to the organization? Oh, yes. Of course. Right, no, I'm thinking of another One cutscene. eradication at Axel's hands was enough to learn where not to place my trust. He gave you a second lease on life. He ripped me away from the one thing I care about. I don't require humanity. Give me my research. I must see it to fruition, no matter the cost. Um. The replicas. Yes. <laughs> Soon they will replace, not just replicate. Given a heart, they can become just as real as any human. What excellent tidings. I would hate to think we invited you back into our ranks, only for you to fail to deliver our final vessel, Vexen. <laughs> what a twist! It's not like we were just talking about him. Or what something. a twist! So, did, did all right, someone, that wasn't the cutscene I was thinking of. Did someone but... make those pillars, or did they just conveniently find pillars that remind them of their chairs? Hey, a new zone. You guys yes. <laughs> See, I do very much suggest Monsters Inc. first, even if you didn't want to deal with, even if you did want to deal with Frozen, because Frozen's the higher battle level. How convenient then. Oh, we got some treasure spheres we can vibe at. Yep. Do be treasure sphere hunting time. I don't mind. This is where the hardest super boss in OG Kingdom Hearts 3 hid. You it just, wasn't something like, you fought as Sora, it was something you fought as a gummy ship. Seriously? Yeah. The, 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 the super boss pre remind was. Yeah, this, the, the hardest boss in the game was a gummy ship boss. To be fair, there's a very hard Super Boss Gummy Ship mission in uh, Cage 2. Is there? Yeah. I've never actually done the Gummy Ship missions to find out. Uh, you know the uh, final Gummy Ship route, the one with the Dreadnought? Vaguely. Um, one of the uh, missions has you fight like a massive nobody. Like a nobody ship or an actual nobody that... I believe it was an actual nobody. I don't... I don't know if this would mean anything to you, but the final... Uh, the, the secret gummy ship boss is called Schwarzgeist. And it's from the... It's from a game that the company who developed the gummy ships for Kingdom Hearts 3 made. Guys. Why is this thing rocking? To make it harder. Faster. Also, uh, I don't know if it's started yet, but in some of them there will also be fake circles. Like, they'll turn if you shoot them, but they don't connect to anything. I'll keep an eye out. Looks like this one's fine. Yeah, that might be uh, the third the, the third area that they do that. Hooray! So much loot. Let's see. Yeah, you see that big tornado in the center of the map? That's where the super boss is hiding. To even enter the tornado, you need a ship that has four stars in speed, though. So... So I can't accidentally stumble into it. Yeah, you have to you have to actively build a ship that's fast enough to go in there. Can I actually damage this? It doesn't look like it. No. Damn. Also, I believe in this, this is the uh, zone where... Somewhere around here, you can find the remains of the pirate ship from Kingdom Hearts 2. Oh, neat.
th this is pretty cool. Like, I love the gummy ship in this game. I wish the gummy ship like that had always been like this. Instead of freaking discount Starbucks. That's an insult to discount Starbucks. True. At least in Kingdom Hearts 1's case. It wasn't terrible in Kingdom Hearts 2, but it wasn't great either. There were only a couple levels I actually liked. Although I will say that Kingdom Hearts 3's gummy ship never has a high, like, uh, that one level right before Aladdin. Oh, the highway? Yeah, they, where, where they got that badass music playing. Like, that track sounds like it should be in a Sonic the Hedgehog level, not Kingdom Hearts. Uh, did I get lost? Nope, there it is. Let's stay careful, you're getting real close to where our boss is. What a cheeky motherfucker! This reminds me of those enemies on Olympus. Kinda. You've already killed a health bar off of it though, so... I'll never unhear the angry video game nerd theme from that part of the song. Hey, get back here, you bitch! Come here and fight me like a worm! Seriously? So, is this a heartless? It's a worm. I don't know what this is. I just know it's a gummy ship boss. I mean, the one near Toy Story was a giant toy. This one isn't even required. This is just an extra one. Oh. Um, I have several questions. Now there's two. How lewd. Oh, uh, I saw Eternals yesterday. Actually- What's Eternals? Um, the new Marvel movie. Oh. I forgot there was a new Marvel movie. It was actually pretty decent. Uh, the only thing I did Marvel related yesterday was get disappointed that I'm, it's basically confirmed that Tobey Maguire's gonna be in the MCU movie and I hate Tobey Maguire. Oh my God, he's such a terrible actor. How now they do? Convinced the, I'm convinced the only pe reason people like him is because of the nostalgia for the old Spider-Man movies they watched as a kid. I don't see how they confirmed it in that trailer. There's a scene where Lizard gets punched by nothing. And it's basically into the Spider-Verse. Yeah, that's true. I did notice Lizard got freaking wiped by nothing. I mean, I would love to be wrong if they... If they just have a different actor playing other Spider-Mens, I will like the movie a lot more. But I am just... Uh, I liked MCU Spider-Man. It was finally a Spider-Man I actually liked. And now I'm annoyed because they think they're going to introduce the Spider-Man that I didn't like. Especially Tobey Maguire. You know, the guy who's the reason I thought Spider-Man was a bad character for so long. I didn't mind Tobey Maguire's Spider-Man. I thought it could have been better, but it, it wasn't Tobey Maguire's acting style is horrible. I hate the thing, like that whispering voice that he does for everything. Ugh.
Why does it move in one direction sometimes and the other direction other times? So sometimes it likes going clockwise, other times nah man, counterclockwise. And so apparently these things are in Treasure Planet? That's what Danny said. Um... It's been a long time since I've seen Treasure Planet. But... I believe I recall there being, like, huge golden orbs in it, yeah. Oh, hey, look! I can try farming some Keyblade upgrades on my way. E. Man, more Damascus. Well, fluorite's in the other one. You're not going to get fluorite from this area. Oh, I see. Makes sense. That checks out. Man, I like how the way I did this, we're actually going to be pretty close to Monstropolis when we finish the e. last one. Like, I lined these up pretty impressively. And the three orbs are really all you need to do to be prepared for any of the bullshit coming up. Like, there's nothing gummy mission-wise it's too hard to do without the help of the three orbs. that our first worlds have been a Disney World and a Pixar World, and then a Disney World and a Pixar World again. And then the last worlds are Big Hero 6 and Pirates of the Caribbean. So, a Disney World and technically a Marvel World. Because Big Hero 6 is a Marvel property. Yeah. The only Marvel in Kingdom Hearts so far. I had really high hopes for the Big Hero 6 world, but it's... It's just okay. The story's decent, but I really don't like exploring the world. Why the hell is my gummy ship level so high? Because you did the orbs. Boy, I keep this up, I'll have enough parts to make whatever the hell gummy ship I want if I want to. Doesn't take much. Neon. I love this freaking ice field aesthetic. Yeah, part of it's really icy because it's in the same like near frozen. I believe the pirate ship from 2 is somewhere near Pirates of the Caribbean. That's brilliant. Oh, that was a warp crystal. Careful, there's a boss in there. I guess it was a required boss anyway. Y'all motherfucker. Dread Shark. He's gonna take you back to the past. I do not trust <laughs> these things he's leaving everywhere. Yeah. Oh. 
When he uh, starts biting and coming towards the screen, it's dangerous to do so, but hitting his mouth, I believe, does more damage with bullets. Not with your face. Got it. I don't know, it's just my imagination, because it's one of the few times it's easy to get a crap ton of bullets in on him. But I swear his mouth is a weak point. I mean, I believe it. I almost lost track of myself on screen for a second. There were a whole lot of particle effects. Then it gets worse once you get an A. Why is my ship going Super Saiyan? Whenever you get an A rank in a mission, that... Yeah, I... I guess... The, yeah. I've, I've witnessed it. I'm just confused why it happens. I don't know. I don't know. I heard someone join us. Hello? Yeah, it's me. Hello. Oh, yo, Danny. You made it! Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Made it. Hey, hey, hey. Made it. Made what? Wait, are you guys doing another stream or? Yeah. We're in Kingdom Hearts 3 right now. Oh. Just finished Corona and now I'm in Monstropolis. The other I didn't realize the case. I didn't realize. Oh, my bad. Well, I mean, I'm probably joining in for just a little bit. Yeah, that's all right. all right. Good to have you for the time. Thank you. Oh, yeah, you are. I feel silly. I didn't know you were streaming today. <laughs> and it was kind of a spur-of-the-moment idea. It was Andrew's mm -hmm. idea, too, actually. I was just uh, sort of like, eh, why not? I have the free time this morning. Sora, you look edgy as frick. Uh, oh, have you not seen his monster design? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. They scared the shit out of each other. You think after Halloween Town they'd be used to this stuff, right? Why do you You'd think after Halloween monster? Town this wouldn't unnerve him, but Well, Halloween Town well, you both scared me. Kind of looked a bit closer to costumes. Seriously? Well, yeah. Okay, that kind of makes sense. Blend in here? So it's just like, my god, I look like a furry. <laughs> you are a furry. Could you guys take a few steps back? You're giving me the is his hair a fin? Uh, kind of is, yeah. Come on. I think our new look could turn out to be lots of fun. So we're with the new goofy, goofy is the creepiest looking one, so that is true. Weirdos live Just because of those peepers. Yeah, his eyes. He's got so Yozora's eyes. <laughs> <laughs> it says we scare because we care. Doesn't sound very caring. If they look like us, then they could be trouble. Sorry, that's kind of racist. I think we better investigate. Kind of is, yeah. Yeah, actually. Sora, what the hell, man? Shouldn't you know better than that? Okay, so... Oh, that's neat. It is. I like how it says Monstropolis, but you just stay in the factory. We're in Monsters yeah. Inc., but in Monsters Inc., you actually see someone Monstropolis. Mm -hmm. That that's funny. I like Indeed, that. you don't you don't leave the factory like at all. <laughs> so, yeah. I mean, I guess because it does take place in Monstropolis, the city, so... But... Eh. Um. So, yeah, this is supposed to take place between the movie and uh, Monsters at Work. Oh, Monsters at Work takes place immediately after the movie, though, doesn't it? Yeah, it does! It's, that's what I've been told when they've had this segment. That's fine. We got nothing to hide. But you're the CEO! You set the example! Hmm. Guys, guys, it, it's not what it looks like. Okay, listen, that kid over there just popped out of nowhere. <sighs> we gotta call the CDA. Uh, it's a, uh, uh, oh yeah, a code 835. 
<laughs> Are you trying to scare that little girl? Yes! I mean, no, no, no! <laughs> We're done with scare power. Nobody's getting scared. <laughs> Mike, take it easy. <sighs> you should too, huh? Sora. You see? She's happy. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, don't you look stupid right now, Sora? Yes. And Hello. he made a foolish blunder as well. My name is Sora. Got him. Boo. Oh, is that your name? Nice to meet you, Boo. <laughs> huh? Hold on. Isn't this the Wonderland scene? We're not afraid of humans? Mike Wazowski. Kind of is it, actually? Get yeah. Get cold Come out, on, Donald. Boo. I'm Mike Wazowski. Mike Wazowski. <laughs> <laughs> I get well, it, because he has one eye. That googly bear eye. You're a duck? <laughs> I'm goofy. Well, are we not talking about where the rest of their clothes is. went? Oh, we know. Because they just no. have their jackets. Wazowski, right? No. We're not going to talk about it. No, we didn't mention it. No, we bring it up. What's the matter, bro? I mean, Donald's tail is a tooth now. Oh, it's unverse. Yep. Not that, quite. Not yet, dumbasses. Well, it makes sense. They never faced these guys before. No, that's not the Heartless's emblem. What? And how come I feel like I might have seen them before? Yeah, well, seen them before. Friendly. Because you did, you dumbasses. <sighs> So you have seen him before. Here. Kitty will be back. Hmm. Good girl. Those guys are Smart right, Sully. Kid. This has got Seriously, not bad for a three-year-old. Yeah, we gotta keep Boo safe. I'm on it. I love the battle theme here. It is really fun. Yeah, watch out for the unburst oh. slugs. Those things are annoying. Did he yeah. eat my kid Goofy? It did. Yeah. And it causes massive damage. Here we go. I so love I take that one. This was another encounter that, like, it took me several tries in Critical to figure out how to do it. Hey, hey, look at me. I'm Zigbar. I keep doing As that if. almost every time. I can canonically see Sora mocking Zigbar when he pulls out this. Oh, definitely. Ow. Okay, fight! Yeet! For a turtle slug, you're pretty fast. Yeah. Also, when you get out of battle, you unlock the best Keyblade, so... Right. You know, I almost forgot we get to bully Vanitas in this world. So that's exciting. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> nice, Sully. Yeah, Vanitas at the end of this. You put on. <laughs> the last remains of respect for him. <laughs> I was like, if it was just birth by sleep, he'd be a respectable well, villain. But then this happens to him. So any idea who those guys were? Like, well, we have young Xehanort getting couldn't. verbally destroyed. Uh, we have Sora hmm. completely dismissing Marluxia in Tangled. The king told us something about no, not, not, not on purpose, of course. Of uh, Yetus Venetus here. Oh, yeah! Bam! I I'm swear to God, if Lorxene gets oh, anywhere oh, wow, near as embarrassed and frozen, that will be four for four. Actually, no, Lorxene doesn't really and have anything three, funny happen to her. For? Nah, they kind of let it go Aqua, there. Terra and Ventus? The only thing that happened in Lark Scene is, uh, Lark Scene X Elsa fan art. <laughs> yeah, I didn't need, him. I didn't need that in my life, but it happened anyway. I mean, yeah, that sounds about right. I told you what through using that! Yeah, people decided that Lark Scene was the Dom. Who or what you're talking about? That sounds correct. Oh, you'd really like the king. Oh! Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> You guys really didn't um, say much about that shit in two. We've come from far away to get rid of those creatures causing trouble. We're like exterminators. Mm -hmm. Just how far away? Yes. Far, far, far away. Um, oh, is that trademark? Hmm. 
Okay, okay, let's just say we buy all that. Are those creeps dangerous? They sure gave Boo a scare. Sully, I know you've missed her, but it's time to postpone our play date. You're right, Mikey. Let's get our girl home. Okay, so... Uh, what are you planning to do? Let's see. Marley was looking it's for kind a, of a story, pure light. But Boo's tangled. from another world. And mm -hmm. young Zaynor was just being cheeky about replicas in Toy Box. Okay, then. So right. Gonna help you. What's Benita's doing what? here? Just well, being a dick? The might try to call As him usual. Think, think about it, Cam. So we want to what is off. scream energy? Right. No, oh, it is negative power. There go Lundberg. Like, this this we place is built like for Benita's. Okay, yeah, you know what? That actually <laughs> checks out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I like how everything has been making sense so far. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, and Zigbar talking hey, absolute it. sense back in Besides, Olympus. We need to figure out how all those unburdened. Oh yeah. Here. Like, just wrecked Hercules' whole career. I'll feel much better when Boo's uh. back in her own room. This actually Me looks too. like a decently Good cool thing the too. Not too Like, far. it looks mm. cool, too. Come on, fellas! Yeah. Are you sure? When you get to the transformation, you'll see why I absolutely love this Keyblade. <laughs> Heal! That was the same point there, anyway. Mm hmm. Like, the first thing you do when you transform that Keyblade is you should dodge about four times and then use the attack button. That sounds exciting. It is. I mean, I may not use it as much as Andrew, but it is a pretty cool uh, attack there. Where the shit did I get all that fluorite? Uh, probably from the... It uh, might have come from the, the orbs you were unlocking. Probably, yeah. Oh, you know what? That's true. I like how it's symbolized by the frickin' frying pan. Hey, you gotta get yourself one of these. Plus, I'm pretty sure the chain is Rapunzel's hair. Yeah, if only Chain Rave was in this game. Mm hmm For those of us who don't know, Shave Rave was a move- Chain Rave was a move in Kingdom Hearts Coded, where Sora held the Keyblade by the chain, and that's how he swung it. Imagine it if the freaking chain lengthened and it just became a massive swing of destruction. I'd be down. Screams in horror. <laughs> you know, I'm genuinely shocked that Mike actually has a character portrait. I thought for sure they'd make a joke. <laughs> like I'm from... on a video game! <laughs> like, have him be clipped behind Sully. Like, so... sorry. Well, here's the thing. There was a PlayStation UK magazine where yes, they featured... Monster... No, no, but here's the thing. It was, in the original version, they didn't cover his face. That was a joke by Super Butter Buns that looked so accurate that everyone just assumed that was the real one, and now oh. that's the only picture you can find. That's funny. That was an edit! It wasn't the original image. It just feels so right. So, mm -hmm. so this thing makes clones. Yep. And then, oh, and then area effect. Yeah, and then you can shoot lasers. I love it. You're firing your lasers. It's a I mean, the basic combo is pretty decent too, but it is so fun setting up those uh, light clones to blast from all directions. Mm-hmm. Gotta send a home right now, or so help me! So help me! So help me! So, Monsters Incorporated said the thing. rely on screen right power from human me. kids so for energy. So help me. But now we collect their laughter instead. It turns right out, so laughter is ten times so more powerful. So mm -hmm. Well, according to Monsters at Work, it's also, like, really I've unstable. Never figured it out without Boo. Uh, yeah, I guess it's, cool. like, the equivalent of discovering nuclear power. Our ship seems like, like it. super Laughter useful, too. but also super that, unstable. Plus, mm -hmm. remember, they're so used to storing scream energy, <laughs> they probably have on, a lot of issues not. with adjusting their information for. Did you ever watch Monsters at Work? I did, yeah. Alright, yeah, because they did things like they had to build a 
new container because the old containers were too small. They were only collecting a small percentage of all the laugh. This is terrible. Yeah. Look, there's Boo's door. I mean, can't we just call it back as soon as we? Well, goddamn it. Like, it's not like you guys are breaking the law this time. You're the CEO. So, like, let's waste the unverse, and then you can call for the door to come back. We'll have to play another time, Boo. You stay here. <laughs> Ready to clean house? <laughs> yeah, so why was the Wonderland theme playing earlier? Like, I didn't find it, but it was kind of weird. I don't know. I, I, mean, it was, I don't think it was the Wonderland thing. I think it was specifically one of the reaction the themes may have yeah, yeah, the whimsy theme may have played in Wonderland multiple times because you know Wonderland? Because Wonderland is Wonderland. Yeah. I mean it's always whimsy down there. Well, whimsy or fucked up, depending on what you what's going on there. Depending on their time their mood. Yeah, I mean, like, let's talk about the walrus that devoured, like, living oysters. <laughs> oh, because he wants it. Isn't that most oysters? I mean, fair, but still, like, when the oysters are, like, kind of kid-like and everything, I don't know. Like, you look back at certain things, it's like, wow, this is pretty fucked up. Isn't that most of Wonderland? <laughs> <laughs> true, true. I have not watched Alice in Wonderland since I was a kid, so, like, I don't remember it at all. Oh. Tell you this, it definitely held up a lot better than the Burden's Wonderland. I never watched that one at all. It's okay. But it's, uh... It's kind of misleading, too. Obnoxious. We're like the shadows, but even worse. The fire is just trying its hardest. <laughs> that fire was doing its best. <laughs> Someone promote that fire. Like, yeah. It, it was trying. It put 110%. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Um. Okay. Couldn't you have just called, grabbed a boost card? I don't think they have it. Then where the frick did they get Boo from? Well, I think that was place. Because there's visitors in this factory. Right here. Nice. Vanitas took the car. <laughs> Grab onto the door when you're ready. Got it. Um. Plus, we're gonna go through the coolest section of the game. Of the, not the game, but this world. Whose door flew off to? I mean, there's a few little items you can get here, but yeah. Mm-hmm. And uh, a couple, uh, uh, or at least one lucky em yes, emblems. There, I believe there are two lucky emblems in this room, and then yes, two yes. chests. I don't trust those oh. balloons. I keep thinking that the balloons will manipulate because of the disco balls in uh, Toy Story. Mm hmm. I probably already walked right past it without even realizing. Uh, oh, you're talking about the Lucky Emblem? Yeah. I'll tell you this it's not the balloons. It's a weird puzzle trying to track these bastards down. It kind of is. Eh, screw it. Let's just progress. Progression. I'm ready. Progression. I'm ready. Progression. Okay, um... Yeah, so you're doing this. Hold on, don't want you to get hurt. We're so high up. 
I just got a great idea. Who let this bastard back into the facility? Did he get fired and arrested? Yeah, but I guess he got out and wanted to cause havoc again. Did, did they not think to take precautions against the guy that can turn invisible? Wait, no, I don't know. I don't know how Monstropolis Law he works. He got exiled. How the frick did he get back to the monster world? Phineas, maybe? Because remember, he was long That's right, yeah. he had some villains who might find him useful and had the ability to teleport. <laughs> oh, hey, look, Sora remembered he can shoot lasers again. It's very situational. Don't make fun of him. Oh, I see. Okay, so that's the gimmick here. Not bad, actually. Nope. Bruce. Indeed. Whoa! Well, it's a real good thing we didn't get separated. Yeah, that was sub. It's our nope. Mind. We have to power it up. More bad guys. Don't worry, I'll watch Boo. Oh. Sora, we gotta make Boo have to open the door. Excuse me? What? I'll be kind of tempted to have an assistant kill. What? Wait, what? A new report says alleges Activision's boss Bobby Kotick knew about misconduct at the company and threatens to have an assistant killed. Jesus. What? That sounds wild. Uh huh. Jesus. Let's see. I mean, I know people don't like the guy, but jeez. That's a bit extreme. Okay, the only thing I can think of to try to make her laugh is to use slow motion, because I'm not quite sure what it uh, do we need to, like, bully Mike or something? Oh uh, yeah, but that's gonna pop up in a bit. For now, just keep doing what you're doing. Local man abuses heartless with obesity issues. More at, more at 11. <laughs> Man, Sora, you're racist and prejudiced. <laughs> I mean, he got over it pretty quick, but still. <laughs> I know, I know. <laughs> and this is why Terra is the goodest of boys. Terra wouldn't have jumped to these conclusions. Yeah, Terra you know assumes. Fair enough. Yeah, Terra Fair assumes enough. everyone's a good guy. For better or worse. <laughs> For worse, man. I mean, as soon as you an asshole in front of him, Terra gonna kick your ass. That, that is true. But you'll still follow whatever you say. Okay, Come to the Keyblade Graveyard. It's surely not a trap. Why do I still listen to him? <laughs> This is very satisfying. Mm -hmm. Do you want know to be wild? What? I'm immediately thinking back to like the Battle of a Thousand, but with KH3 style. Oh, yeah. yeah, that would be amazing. Oh my god. Like, Battle of a Thousand was sick enough as is. But yeah, imagine with this kind of like freedom and style. And the Keyblade transformations, since you can't really use your drive forms in the battle. Yeah. Yeah, Keyblade transformations don't require Donald and Goofy either. Exactly. Like, you I can mean, even use them in 1v1 fights. If anything, it's kind of a step up from... I know I was super Enterprise. disappointed when I got to the Roxas fight. I was like, oh, I can't wait to pull out a dual wield form so we can have dual wield versus dual wield. And then I remembered Donald and Goofy aren't here. Yeah.
Oh my god, did we just... <laughs> yep. Of course I was the ball! <laughs> I was the ball. I got fire from that! Is that because I gave Mike such a sick burn? I guess. Yeah. Well, you didn't seem to promote that fire earlier, so... The door's open! So the game heard you. Oh, man. <laughs> you are in what's considered the mid-game world, so... So, that door? door led to a... To another door. Ready? Well, another room to another door. To another ride. Cool. <laughs> Is this not what we're doing, Donald? Donald, shut your face. Alright, here we go again. Aw, shit. Here we go again. Go again. Oh, roll death. credits. <laughs> yeah, roll credits. Well, that was a short game. I mean, so I guess they gotta murder at least one princess of heart. <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> no, no, air horn. Pew, 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 pew. Wait, wouldn't that be two? Because that'd be Sora and Ben. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah you're, you're right. right. You're right. No, 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 Sora filled the darkness. I think it's just Van. Also, like, without Sora, a lot of the other Guardians wouldn't be able to get there either. Hey, didn't you know what? Probably not. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's true. I'm sorry, what were you saying, Cam? Um, it didn't auto-equip Fyra. Do I just have fire and fire? Yeah, you, you, can, you can use any tier spell in this game, so you have to Holy manually geez. equip Fyra. Yeah, so, which could actually work out, because then if you want to, you can equip a lower spell if you don't want to waste magic as much. That's exactly what I was thinking. I mean, I just equipped the highest tier spell anyway, but you can do that. Ha! I can, I can extend the length of the attractions. Ha! If, if you decide to, of course. I mean, it's just, the option is there if you want. Can't say I've ever played this game and thought I needed more attractions. <laughs> Jeez, those things appear at the drop of a hat. That is true. That's... that's neat. That you can actually go back and use the magic instead of it auto-upgrading and that's it. Mm-hmm. It seems a lot of magic builds usually do that a lot. You know, trying... especially in critical mode, because you're meant... Because in this game, the magic bar is actually cut in half as well. I love this meme of uh, Barry Allen running away from something yes! and then screaming. Yes! With the green screen! I love it. I think it. my favorite one so far is Lingering Will. <laughs> I need to see that one. <laughs> yeah, Lingering Will jumps on his Keyblade glider, <laughs> swings around Barry Allen, Barry Allen gets behind him, Barry Allen screams, and then you hear the cage death sounds. I love it. That's perfect. Oh, also the car is from, uh, from the, the t Timeless River, the cars. Yeah, oh, I, yeah. I've seen the Someone did the Barry cars. Allen there. They even had the voice filter over Barry Allen screaming. <laughs> Just all muffled. Yeah. Uh, seriously, why do we just harvest used Chinese food containers for ingredients? For Danny, I have that. Uh, I I just found the one one based off of that uh, a scene from the towards the end of Kingdom Hearts three, where uh, uh -huh. a, a certain character just decided Riku was gonna die. <laughs> I I yeah, I gotta see that. You sneaky bitch! It's my oh, first no. retweet right now. I actually respect that. Oh no. 
that that was actually a sick play by Randall. Mad props. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, no. I, I'm seriously remembering my idea of just complimenting a villain's strategies to their face, and they're like, what? You're, you're supposed to stop me, what? I'm gonna, but also I respect it. How'd we take a wrong turn? <laughs> Who cares? All that matters is that it's the last turn that you losers Okay, so let's spam Blizzard on him. He's Randall. a reptile. Who's <laughs> A creep we banished if only there was actually a Randall boss. Oh, he that's used to be booze scarer. Yeah, there's only like How one Disney boss in? in the game. The door we sent you through is sawdust. Sadly. Yeah, and I almost got turned into somebody's wallet. Oh yeah, he got sent to Florida. Lucky for me, a real nice guy <laughs> came along and fixed the door. So here I am. I mean, that is the worst punishment I can and imagine. Today, True. We sent to Florida and face the Florida man. Leaderboard, baby. Ma, that gator got in. You a top laugh collector? In your dreams, Randall. My laugh totals are off the charts. Well, you are just Who one said big joke. about collecting laughs? But I'm bum. I'm after negative emotions. And my new friends have kindly invaded the factory to get them for me. Hmm. Negative emotions? Yeah, Organization 13 must be helping them. Laughter's just not sustainable. Okay, now I'm trying to imagine what Randall in one of the organization cloaks. Chortle, <laughs> That's really funny. But <laughs> negative that, they're gonna need some material, some very flexible material. I believe Unless Randall's the last organization member. Breaks their little hearts. And they'll stay I did mention yeah, well, I, that they need a Disney member energy. because well, I hate when they when he's a boss fight when he turns invisible. Because the princesses of Car or your little oh, not helpers. Not clean. Hey, hey. He's the obviously not, not clean. He's been here the whole time. I'm gonna be <laughs> around this place. Now, I'm I mean, not clean. your careers. I'm not sure that's a worthy what? use of the of buying the Tarzan license, but oh well. Hey. Have you actually seen Where the I video go? we're referencing when we're calling him not Clayton and obviously not Clayton? It's, uh, okay, well. Game Champs, can you beat Kingdom Hearts at level 1? Oh. No, I did not. Yeah, so during the entire part where he's explaining how he did the Clayton fight, he calls Clayton not Clayton, and he calls the chameleon obviously not Clayton. Then we can take oh, gotcha, gotcha. Every single time. So, so first I do this to not Clayton, and then I do this to avoid obviously not Clayton, so that not Clayton, yeah, it's that kind of a thing. Gotcha, gotcha. My bad. They think they're funny and they're correct. Like, I respect it. It's hilarious. It's I, like, I like their channel. I wish they uploaded a little more often, but I like their channel. They just did a Mega Man 3 run, like, yesterday. Without taking damage, right? Yeah, Mega Man 3, no damage the entire game. If they take one oh, damage, they start the game over from the title screen. Yeah, no save states or anything. Just complete reset from title screen. Yeah. How many? Uh, okay, I'm gonna ask how many restarts that did that took. I don't know. A lot. <laughs> I was gonna say, Mega Man is notoriously hard back then. I have, I have only beaten Mega Man Seven and Eleven, so yeah. I've only played and beaten two, and that took me a lot. I can't get anywhere near the end of two. Seven jived with me though. It's something about the bigger sprites that was just able to. Yeah. Well, seven is uh. Is that Super Nintendo or is that PlayStation? Yeah, seven's okay. the, the SNES game, and then eleven is okay. the new one. Yeah, I know about eleven. Seven's my favorite game in the series. Though. Rude. Hey, what's with the machines? Gone. I wish oh, more than workers. just uh, Mega Man There's 7 no looked like Mega Man 7. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this must be what Randall meant by improvements. <laughs> no shit, Donald. Nothing we can't handle. Yep. Sully, maybe I you and Mike should play the X Games. They're a little too fast-paced for me. Right. 